welcome to Coxie's Picks. If you like what you see, don't forget to subscribe. Enjoy. Hello and welcome to Coxie's Picks and today we're going to be looking at upgrading my forged 500 and model 400 handcuffs to the blue multi-pull solution. Um, you don't get given a key and you only have to, you have to buy them uh, individually. So when you're buying them, make sure that you have two rather than one, otherwise you'll only have half the cuffs done. Right? Because they don't supply a key, you will be caught out because that hasn't got the split. The official key is black and has a split like so, so you can see that it operates quite nicely. But if you don't have that, not a problem. You could make yourself a tool key, which you can see is a normal Smith & Wesson with a split and slightly shrunk down, so stand by. Then it goes, and you can see it functions. If manufacturing is not your forte, you could possibly get away with using one of the Chinese clones. And let's just see if that operates. Round it goes, and voila. It was a bit stiff, but it got the job done. And that's from the Chinese clone Yules. So there are possibly lots of solutions for actually getting a key to operate in these. So, without using any specialist tools, um, I'm just going to use the happy tool because I've shown how to make one of these, but most people do have a bypass blade and a hook. So let's get right into it. The first thing you want to do is you want to get your cuffs and you want to make sure that the double lock is not set. Push the bow all the way past and lock your finger in place. Then you're going to take your hook aspect of your tool and you're going to place it in and you're just going to wiggle and lever, it says confidently, in until you can see that the working parts has come up at the rear. Then using your bypass blade, reach in and slowly lever the working parts up and out. And hopefully you can see that nicely. So there we go, the working parts are up and out. So we've got them out. Next thing we want to do is we want to line up our keyway. Sorry, line up our keyway. And we're going to go in the same angle. And the reason being is there's a an anti-shim and a jaw just there that we need to catch into. So line it up. Let's try to do this on the camera. Sorry. And it goes at a weird like 45 degree angle per se, jiggle it around until it gets to this point here. And you can see there's a notch just there. What we'll do is we'll use the ASP key to do this and you push it down and it's in place. Now, before you swing the bow through, make sure that you have a key that functions because you need to make sure that you can actually unlock these. And then we're gonna swing it through, pull back, make sure that there's no movement and we've done the first half. So let's try and quickly go through. I'll speed this part of the video up and then we'll go on to the next one. So. Okay, so that is the 500s upgraded. So we now have the high security model. Yes, thank. Thank you, Sammy. Uh, now we have the ASP 500s upgraded, so we now know that we've got the high security variant. Uh, we can do exactly the same process on the other hand. We can do exactly the same process on the other handcuffs, like so. And I will also speed up this aspect of the video because it is identical in the process. So in with the hook. Okay, there we have it. We have the Model 400 and the Model 500 upgraded to the higher security blue double pull. Now, I am going to show later on what we can do with all these spare bits, but that's definitely for another video. Thank you very much for watching. Stay safe, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.